Assalamualaikum warahmatullahi wabarakatuh So today we are going for Exploration in Kuala Lumpur Yeah, so what are we going to do? Nakit So basically we are going to take a look on the foods So yeah, a lot of clothes on foods Sarah, do you have anything to say? Uh, let's just check it out and find what's the best in here Yeah, let's Lisa? go cafe hunting Hi, as for me, Rashdan, I ordered the Hokkien Mee at a price of 13 ringgit. I order this food because it is rarely found at any normal restaurant and it is usually served in a Chinese restaurant. But as for Ali Mutu and Ahok restaurant, they serve this food. This is actually a combination of noodles, cabbage, soy sauce, chili, garlic, chicken stock and chicken cube. And as for me, I would recommend you guys to try this food. Happy trying! I chose Nyonya Laksa which is RM30 ringgit per dish. It's a, it is a dish full of flavour and a combination of noodles, half water egg, curry powder, laksa leaf, lemongrass, shrimp, turmeric, kalangal, shrimp paste, slices of cucumber, tofu and ended with a lime. Next is Asam Laksa. The price was only 13 ringgit and I personally choose Asam Laksa as this is my favourite food and it is also a must try dish from Ali, Mutu and Ahok. So it is a combination of noodles, tamarind, lemongrass, mackerel, galangal, added up with a chilli, shrimp paste and slices of cucumbers on top. So I have chosen nasi lemak ayam goreng. This is because nasi lemak ayam goreng is the one of favorite choice by the customer of Ali Mutu and Ahok restaurant. Nasi lemak ayam goreng is the best combination of coconut rice, boiled egg, fried chicken, peanut, anchovies, sambal, and cucumber. And the price is thirty ringgit and ninety cent. You should try it.
The next dish is nasi goreng kampung which its price is at RM13 ringgit. And I choose nasi goreng kampung as my dish as it comes with a big portion for one of Ali Mutu and Ahok. Nasi goreng kampung is a combination of fried rice, sunny side up egg, water spinach, shrimp, anchovies, chicken cube, fermented shrimp, paste and also slices of cucumber. So for the drinks, we bought the ice with 3 ringgit 60 cent, kopi o panas with 5 RM 2 ringgit 50 cent, cham ice with 3 ringgit 60 cent and kopi panas with RM 3 ringgit and 10 cent. Hi, Assalamualaikum. My name is Siti Sarah Binti Muhammad Suhaimi. I will continue to the reason why specific consumer based online uh, platform that been choose by Ali and Mutuk Ahok. So first, they have their social media, Instagram and Facebook of Ali Mutuk Ahok. The reason why they choose is because our first are ready targeting. What do you mean by ready targeting? Uh, there's almost 97% of Malaysian actually use social media in their daily life. So it's a very easy accessibility for this consumer to just jump, jump on into the social media world and search whatever they want. So apart from that, from this 50% of these uh, people that use social media, almost of them come from Generation Y and Generation Z. They know what they want they do social media. Hence why uh, Ali and Mudaho have the concept of Aesthetic Cafe which is one of the major interests to this uh, new generation. And second are uh, online retail shop. Shopee. Ali and Mutu Ahok sell the three in one coffee in Shopee. So why they choose Shopee to begin with? Shopee is one of the largest e-commerce platform in Malaysia. Apart from that, it's an easy cross-border sale because Shopee is not only available in Malaysia, but they also available in China, Philippines, and Brunei, Singapore, and many more. In Indonesia also. So hence why it's very easy for them to actually reach the new market group apart from one that existed in Malaysia. And customer experience is also very seamless. Reason why is because Shopee is very easy to use. You and I already experienced Shopee and how we use in the daily life with a different payment option also become one of the major attractions such as SP Letter, Shopee Pay and also set David Card, Online Transition, COD and many more. Apart from that, Ali Amutu Ahok doesn't have to concern about shipping and logistic because it already be taken care by Shopee itself. A second are food del a third is actually food delivery services, grab food, food pandas and also their own delivery uh, application. The reason why they choose food delivery, uh, food delivery services application is because it's convenient for the customers. Especially since the, uh, the pandemic, there are many SOPs, restricted dining in and many more causes to the loss of sale. So it's very important for them to choose this platform to increase back their sale and also to minimize the contact, especially the strict SOP in the cafe itself. So Apart from that, they reach a wider target audience through the use of application also. And many people who are not aware about Ali Amitu Ahok can just jump on into the full application and they can be aware about the restaurant itself. Hence, so why these are three specific online customer based platforms that are being used by Ali Amitu Ahok to actually help their restaurants and cafes and also bring a greater impact and marketing to their uh, restaurants and influencers or into customer to jump in and to get more about them also.
Assalamualaikum for the payment method at this restaurant they've been using three types of payment first the normal cash payment where we pay using our money second an online transfer where the customers transfer their money from their banks to the restaurant's bank and lastly an e-wallet system whereby they're using such as QR pay grab pay or touch and go even boost so for me it's great to have these three types of method of payment this is due to it will give flexibility to their customer to actually pay their food with ease hi as for the target market we do believe that this restaurant are targeting on three main targets first aesthetic food lovers for us these people are looking for a good Instagrammable place with a high quality food and affordable price. So we do believe at this restaurant they provide those and also the setup of the restaurants are very very great. Second, local food lovers. As at this restaurant, they not only serve one type of food cuisine but they provide varieties of local food which is came from Malay, Chinese, Indian and even others too. So we do believe that the local food lovers would love to go to this restaurant. And lastly, the middle and elderly age. Even though they have some Instagrammable places, but we do believe that the style of this restaurant actually also attracting the middle and elderly age, which makes this restaurant great because they not only targeting one target, but they have so many targets, which actually at the end of the day, attracting every single one of us and every single type of customer. Hi, Assalamualaikum. My name is Rashdan. So I have ordered the Hokkien Mee at this restaurant. So I would like to recommend every single one of you to try this cuisine because especially to whom love the Chinese food because it consists of all those flavorful ingredients like the chicken, the soy sauce, the Hokkien Mee itself. It is very, very, very nice and it has a very great taste. So the price of 13 ringgit, I do believe it is very affordable because the location of the restaurant in Kuala Lumpur. So I do believe that it is very affordable, it is very great and it is it has a great taste. So I'll rate 4 or 5. So don't forget to try this menu. the Nyonya Laksa at Ali Mudo Ahok and it's a very good combination of uh, the sweetness of the santan and the kickness of the sambal including a, a shrimp and many condiments that complement the laksa 
that they preserve. I will rate that as 4 over 5. Because for me, I hope we, the summer will be a little bit of spicy. But for overall, it's a very good dish and it's a very big portion that you can share with everyone. Okay, so for the asam laksa, I would say it looks very, very appetizing and I love how flavorful this soup is with all the fresh ingredients that do it but I wouldn't rate it too high because to me, it is more on a salty side um, and uh, it just, it's just not for me but I would say recommend it to others so as for the rate, I would rate it 3 over 5 So when I order nasi lemak uh, ayam goreng, my expectation that nasi lemak will be very good because you are eat at the some place that very famous in the local place. But after I received the nasi lemak, I really disappointed because the first one is the portion is like a normal portions, and the taste is like you can get the more better in the road, street road everywhere in Malaysia and. The most disappointed thing for me is they are using uh, sambals, instant sambal. So I'm not really into it. So I rate it for 2 over 5. I would say that Ali Butu and Ahok did a great job in serving their nasi goreng kampung. The taste of sambal paste is perfect in there. And also they did serve with prawn and chicken. So I already 5 or 5.